Hello everyone. In this video session, we are going to attempt next question in computer organization. This question was asked in 2016 and set to for one mark. The question is a processor has 40 distinct instructions and 24 general purpose registers. A 32 bit instruction word has an opcode, two register operands and an immediate operand. The number of bits available for the immediate operand field is. So let us first draw an, a rectangle to represent this 32 bit wide instruction. So let's this be a 32 bit wide instruction and it has got four fields. First of them is opcode which is an unique identifier of the instruction and then followed with two register operands. So let us name them as RG1 and RG2. Two register operands. What does register operand means is that the value of the operands lie in one of the general purpose registers. Now immediate operand is the fourth field. So what is an immediate operand? The value is part of the instruction. Right? So like this one say add r1 comma r2 comma 4 where r1 and r2 are register operands and 4 is an immediate operand right fine so now let us find the number of bits that would be required for this opcode field so the number of bits that would be there in this opcode field should be sufficient enough to identify 40 distinct instructions right so this opcode field is, is an unique identifier of each of this 40 distance instructions and the formula for calculating the number of bits in opcode field would be equals to log base 2 number of instructions so here number of instructions is 40 and on that we need to apply ceiling operator so this is opcode uh, width and log base to 40 ceiling would be equals to 6. Log base to 40 is 5 point something on top of that if we apply operate uh, ceiling operator then we would get 6. So what's ceiling operator is for on a fractional value if we apply ceiling operator then it returns us the least integer among all the integers greater than this fractional value. So the least integer among all the integers greater than 5.3 is 6. So this is what ceiling operator returns. Least integer among all the integers greater than the fractional value. Greater than or equals to the fractional value. That means if we take 6.0 ceiling then also it would return 6. Greater than equals to. Alright. So 40 log base 240 is 5 point something and on that if we apply ceiling operator we would get 6. Right. So opcode field would be 6 bits wide. And now question is why 6 bits wide? Why do we require 6 bits to identify 40 distinct instructions? So let's say if the opcode field is single bit wide. Right. So either we can assign a 0 or a 1 uh, to this opcode field. And with 0 and 1, we can identify two distinct operations, two distinct instructions, right? So one of them we can identify with a 0 and another we can identify with a 1. And similarly, if the opcode field is 2 bits wide, right? So with that, if the opcode field is 2 bits wide, we can identify four different instructions with this opcode value 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. that means four instructions can be identified with two bits wide opcode field similarly if we have three bits wide opcode field then we can identify eight different instructions with this three bits wide opcode field why because with this three bits wide uh, opcode field we can generate eight different binary patterns and with eight different binary patterns we can identify eight different instructions. So in general if we have n bits of opcode field we can identify at the max 2 to the power n instructions. Right. 
so now 2 to the power 5 is 32 that means with 5 bits we can identify maximum 32 different instructions so 5 bits is not enough for uh, identifying 40 distinct instructions we would need 6 bits 2 to the power 6 is 64 which is greater than 40 so minimum 6 bits are required in the opcode field for identifying 40 distinct instructions right so opcode field is 6 bits wide uh, with the same token we can uh, we can say as there are 24 different general purpose registers so number of bits required to identify a particular register out of this 24 uh, different registers is log base to 24 ceiling so log base to 24 ceiling is 5 log base to 16 is 4 log base to 24 is 4 point something and on that if we apply a ceiling we would get 5 so register 1 field would take 5 bits and similarly the second register field would also take 5 bits and the remaining bits out of this 32 bits would be there for the immediate operand so that is equals to 32 minus 5 plus 5 10 plus 6 that is 16 so 32 minus 16 is 16 so immediate operand field would be 16 bits wide and that is our answer so here in the blanks we need to fill it with 16 thanks for watching bye